What's up, Jimmy? Patrick, what's kicking? Patrick says, I'm here tonight. Let's go. It's Tuesday. We got to do it, y'all. Let's talk. Let's go. Let's roll. What's up, Aaron? Got my boy Sean in the house. What's up, Dale? Dale trucking. Rolling them dollars. Got Terry in the house. What's up? Hey, man, what's kicking? Alan. It's Tuesday. It's raining. It's gloomy. It's doomy. We just got to hang out, y'all. Got to stay in where it's warm and dry. That's right, Patrick. It's always busy. Jimmy says, you got that Hemi and juice. We better leave that Hemi out of juice. We better leave that Hemi out. What's up, Jimmy Dell? Robert, what's kicking? Gene, Michael, what's going on? Y'all roll on in here, roll on in here. Got my bud Brandon watching. What's up? Got Danny in the house. Patrick, what's kicking? Let's roll, let's roll. William, what's going on? Hey, man, I've been on it like a detective, man. We got it figured out. I think, I think I'm ready. I think I'm ready. We got, I gotta, I, I'll show you in a little bit. What's up, Lance? Mark, what's going on? Ruben in the house. What's going on, Dennis? Ryan, what's kicking? Mackie, what's going on? Just staying warm and dry, y'all. Just staying warm and dry. What's going on, Jeremy? Got Michael in the house. What's up? Ruben, you keeping everybody straight? Woo, Jimmy Dale, we, we, I'm working, man. I'm working, I'm working. What's up, William? Rick in the house, what's up? Corey, what's going on? Miss Sherry? Lance, you know Russell ain't here yet. He ain't trying to act like he was earlier, two hours today. And he ain't even here yet. What's going on, Michael? Stephanie, what's up? Mr. Dennis? Let's see here, Patrick, what's going on? Donnie? What's up, James? Got old juice over there lurking, y'all. I'm getting parts in. I'm working. Got my buddy. Got my buddy Blake in the house. What's up? Cecil, what's going on? Mark? What's going on, James? Got Kevin in the house. Mr. Jeffrey, what's going on? Bill, 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 what we got kicking? What's going on, Jamie? Got Shane rolling through. Is that a tutor? Tutor, what we doing? He said Kingport, Tennessee. What's up? James, what's going on? Got Mike in the house. Jimmy Dale, dino, the dino session on Assassin went well. I learned a lot. I learned we had a problem. So we had to cut things short just a little bit and had to come on home, which, uh-oh, uh not that big a deal, though. I learned a lot, learned a lot. Now, I'm getting it fixed. Figured out, figured out we had a little problem. What's going on, Mike? Eric, Todd, what's going on? Tom in the house? Raymond, what's kicking? Mr. Larry, all the way from Wyoming, what's going on? Got my buddy Caleb jumping in there. What's going on, Levi? That's right, James. I'm going to be tearing. I'm going to rip all through Mississippi, 2024. What's going on, Roy? Got Rick in the house. Herbert, what's going on? 
Norman, what's up? Got my buddy Jeff Reed. What's going on, Jesse? From sunny Florida. Got Mr. Cotton in the house. Andy, what's going on? Jonathan, what's up? That's right, Jimmy Dale. I've been on it like a detective. Got it figured out, though. Got it figured out. Good thing I went down there to that dyno, because it, it taught me a lot. It taught me a lot. Found some problems. Uh, gonna, get it, gonna get it fixed up. Mr. Harrell, what's going on? Got Jeff in the house. Got Mr. Bill, what's going on? That's right, Herbert. Stay warm. What's up, Dennis? Dennis, I was trying to get a guest on the show tonight. I don't know if he's going to come back or not, but Jeff James was here earlier. I told him to come back. Norman, what's up? Jonathan, what's up? It's rolling by, y'all. I'm trying to keep up. Y'all don't be mad at me if I miss you. I'm trying to give everybody a shout-outs. What's going on, Michael? John, what's up? Andy says, man, cut all the BS. Got my buddy Chad. He said, cut all the BS. Let's talk about the dino. That's right, Patrick. Got to do that. What's up, Landon? Raymond, what's going on? What's up, Jesse? Richard, what's going on? I'm trying to read, trying to read. So, as y'all know, I hauled the old assassin down to Fuel Tech. Had a lot of fun. Learned a lot of stuff. What's going on, John? What's up, Jeremy? Cecil, what's up? So anyway, what I learned is, and for those of y'all that maybe clicked on the Assassin page prior to this live, you might have seen a pretty cool little photo. So when you get done with this live, you might check out that little photo because we had a little little scare jump through there right quick for a second on there. And they, now y'all don't ban, let's see, Patrick, uh, Pete, Toby, what's up, Maverick, what's going on? I don't mean to miss anybody, but I'm talk if I'm talking, you know, I gotta concentrate and I can't I can't concentrate, walk, talk, and all that, and, and I'll be missing everybody. What's going on, Tommy? Let's see here. Tim in the house. Roy. So y'all know I can't read it, talk, and and, and, and give shout outs, but I'm gonna try my best, y'all can believe that. But anyway, so on the dyno, everything was going good. Uh, we did realize that we were lacking in fuel pump. Uh, for this monster, so I had to slip across the street over there to the Proline race engines, and uh, my buddy John, uh, they keep a lot of stuff in stock over there. They got me fixed up with a with a nice new big gallon fuel pump that mine couldn't quite cut the mustard. So we got a fuel pump on it, but we kept having some gremlins that just didn't look right. The thing's making crazy power, but this some things ain't looking right, and then the next thing we know, we see fire. We get a we get a nice burst of fire and flash. I put a picture of it on the assassin page just a few minutes ago. So when you guys get done with this, if you want to go back and look at it, what's up, Greg, Jonathan, Joanne? I'm I'm trying to, I'm gonna try to talk and and give my shout outs. I appreciate everybody for tuning in with us and jumping on with us every Tuesday night. It gives us an opportunity to hang out. Look at some cool hot rod parts. See what I got going on. What's up, Thomas? But anyway, we had an intake valve, guys. Uh, we knocked a seat. And when you're dealing with this kind of horsepower, when you got stuff making over 3,000 horsepower, stuff is moving. Uh, you know, this thing's trying to have babies all the time, and, and you've just got to come to terms with it. What's up, Ralph? What's up, Thomas? And so... This is very extreme. It's very brutal at what we do with a combo like Assassin. And, you know, I expected to have some kind of problems, but, um, you know, not bad, but not great. Little setback, but not that big a deal. Things could have been far worse, uh, you know, had I carried the car to the track and tried to run it versus going to the dyno and finding the gremlins. Could have resulted in a big fire, could have resulted in a crash, could have resulted in a lot of things. So 
I'm very, very thankful that I had an opportunity to go down there. I am going back. I'm going to get this thing fixed. Um, but like I said, we've got an intake valve that's leaking. It's, it's, it's uh, knocked the seat around a little bit. Um, I'll swap the camera around. We'll look at a little jewelry. We'll look at some jewelry. Woo! It's pretty, y'all. That's all I can tell you. But anyway, uh, got, a, got, a, got a seat that's got bumped around, so she's got a pretty good amount of leak down, and, you know, the combustion's trying to run back up the intake, which could have resulted in something really, really, really bad. But luckily, uh, you know, luckily I was able to catch it, and, uh, and so I've got, I've got the heads and intake off of her. Uh, everything cleaned up. And I'm going tomorrow, we're going to get that fixed, and uh, we'll get that bad boy back together. So I should have it, uh, you know, I, I plan on having it back together by the, by the weekend. Uh, we'll, uh, you know, I'll make, uh, I'll make arrangements, and uh, we'll get back down to Fuel Tech, and we'll finish what we started. You know what I mean? But very, very good results, uh, even shutting it off early, guys. I mean, it was right at 3,000 horsepower, uh, having to shut it off early because it, had an intake valve leaking and obviously the intake valve leaking we was down a lot of power on cylinder one so those are the kind of things you run into when you when you start dealing with with this kind of power i mean it just it just is what it is and uh that's what we got to deal with who wants to look at beetlejuice Ooh, my little beetle so anyway Little Beetlejuice, it's getting a little love. I got the tunnel in it. Got the dry shaft in, guys. Uh, dry shaft came in. So it's, uh, it's like ragu. It's in there. Got the tunnel done. I'm steady clicking things off the list. For the ones that didn't tune in last week, I got the headers built last week. Got the hot side all done. Uh, comes all the way back. You know, all the way to the wastegates. Got the wastegate over there. I got that side done. So... Uh, hot side is near completion for the ones that didn't tune in last week. If you was here last week, you seen I already had I already had this amount of stuff done. So the bins just came in today that I was waiting on to connect this V band back, and it'll turn and come up and it'll hook into here that I've already got all of this stuff done and welded. So it's uh old Beatles making a little making a little. Uh, headway guys, you know, but obviously I'm wrestling a lot of a lot of obstacles. It's just, you know, life life in the in the in the in the BB customs shop. So it just is what it is, you know. I'm good at tearing up stuff. Uh, I don't even have to try, y'all. I don't even have to try. I just I'm just real good at tearing up stuff. So you know it is what it is. So anyway, so let me catch up. Let me catch up. Who's saying what? Am I missing anything good? Bobby in the house. Mr. Andy says, look sweet. Let me try to go back. Johnny, Allen, Reuben, Patrick, Roy, Jackie, Adam, Tim. I'm, I'm trying to catch up, y'all. Y'all don't be mad at me if I don't give you a shout out. Just keep, just keep typing. If I don't give you the shout out, just keep typing. I'm going to see you. Tim, what's going on? Let's see. Greg, see Donna, Dana, uh, Donnie. Let's see. Ralph, what's up? So, got Joe in the house. So, so that's the deal, y'all. That's what I've been doing. That's what I've been doing. Tearing up stuff. Not really. What's going on, Braden? Frank, what's up? So, Juice has been getting the love. Assassin's been getting the whooping on. And uh, it fights back a little bit. What's up, Jeff? Thank you, buddy. What's going on, Bill? Got, got Miss Belinda in the house. What's up? What's going on, Steven? There's my coyote killer. Got Michelle in the house. Oh, he said, it's Eli. Eli, Eli's stalking. He's like, uh, what do you call it, incognito? Boy. What's going on, John? Frank, what's kicking? Philip in the house. Let's see here. I'm trying to keep up, y'all. I always go back. Y'all remember now. When you're typing, I may not see it right now, but I always go back later. And I, I like to thumb through and read and see what people saying. So so don't think that I ain't uh 
Don't think that I don't see y'all. Linnell, what's up? Russell. Russell finally made it. Or maybe I'm just now seeing him. Y'all think Russell been in here earlier? You think he's just now getting in here? So, uh, what's going on, Kenneth? What's up, Chuck? What's going on? Y'all just keep them coming. Keep them commenting. I'll try to give you shout outs. If I don't see you, I'm sorry. I will try. And, uh, what's going on, Van? Gotta get a new hair, dude. It don't get no better, man. That's as good as I got. I have to put a wig on. If I do that, my wife will run me down. What's going on, Patrick? Russell says I was asleep. Like he's been in here from the beginning, y'all. What's going on, Ricky? You got Ron in the house. What's up? Eli, you know I'm I'm thrashing on old juice, but it just takes time, buddy. I have to wrestle this one, I have to wrestle this one, I have to wrestle the ones outside. Whew. It's always something. Got my buddy Mark in the house. Let's see here. What you got, Jimmy Dale? Thank you, buddy. Got Walt in the house. What's up? Oh, how? Ralph, what you got? Ralph, you know, I tell hello to the wife. I'm sorry. I don't see her on there. I'm trying to get it, y'all. What's up, Tony? Daryl, what's up? Mark, what's kicking? He said, I didn't mu miss much in Orlando. All them Orlando folks better be glad that I didn't make it down there because I'd, I'd have put a whooping on all them fools, all them, them whatever gangs and, and, and all them other folks that was thinking they was down there doing big stuff. When I roll in, I'm going to make noise. You can believe that. Miss Sherry, what you got? Let's see here. Miss Sherry, I tried to get Jeff to come back or stay or whatever. He was here earlier, but... He had to go take care of some business. He said he'd be back, but we'll see. Maybe if not, maybe I can uh, get him talked to him next week or something like that. What's going on, Danny? Let's see here. Uh, Steven, what's up? Let's see here. Dylan's car. Dylan got his wheels and tires on his car. He's got it running. He's working on it. What's up, Frank? Yeah, Eli. Dylan's working on his little Mustang. Let's see here. Ralph, what you got? Ralph says... Oh, okay, so she uses... Well, I'm saying what's up to Ralph, so I see you on there, or Miss Ralph. There you go. How about that? Let's see. Mark Mark says, uh, woo, got down to 35. We don't need that. What's up, Raymond? I got to try to catch up, y'all. Tony, it is raining nasty. It's just it's, it's a flood out there. What's up, Billy? I ain't no telling where JJ's at. He probably on a horse or something somewhere. Or spray painting something. You can believe that. What's up, Shane? Frank, what you got? I'm ready for juice too, buddy. Jay, what's kicking? New Hampshire. Woo. All right, let's see here. Let me catch up. Miss Sherry, Miss Sherry, what you got? We didn't make it to Florida. We only had to make the seven-mile ride to Atlanta, and we had to turn around and come back. Let's see here. Sean, that's a lot. I might probably come back that one. We got Corey in the house. What's up? James, what's kicking? Sean says, I'm out in the bar building a little S10 for the daily. I hear you. What's up, we're young? Frank, let's see. Hey, it's all good, Frank. We all having the same amount of fun, no matter what we in. We just doing it. Got my cousin Eddie. What's up? Yeah, Tony, maybe we will be. Let's see, Billy, what you got? Billy working on 69 Chevelle. Got Cowboy Sean, what's up? Got Jason in the house. Let's see, what you got, Jimmy Dale? I know you right. I'm ready for that ice cream. Maybe it won't be long. <laughs> Lance says, JJ done turned into a used car salesman. Hey. You just go back to your old ways. It's in his blood. He loves hustling them cars, that's for sure. Cowboy Sean, the dyno. Dyno was good, but we found a few problems. Found out we needed a different fuel pump. Got that fixed. 
And then we, we finally figured out our problem. We were chasing a uh, bad intake valve. It done knocked the seat around, knocked the valve job off, and we literally uh, had combustion coming back up the intake, and it, it, it literally tried to uh, burst flames out on a, like a bit of a backfire or whatever. So we shut it down. We shut the dyno down right there, and I said, hey, let me take it home. Let me get the heads off. We'll get the uh, 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 we'll get the heads jammed up, retouch that uh, valve job, and I'll get her all back together. Make sure she's sealed up tight and ready to rock. And I'll come on back down there and we'll knock it out. What's up, Lee? Let's say what's up, Rick. Uh, I, on the um, Assassin, I had a 21 gallon. Enderly uh, dual gear pump, and now I have went to this uh, Aeromotive. It's a 25 gallon deal. Uh, that's what uh, my buddy John at, at Proline says they run on all theirs, so that's what I bought from them, and that's what I got on there. So maybe we have enough fuel now. So, got my buddy Harry, what's up? You ain't doing nothing? He said, I'm trying, man, I'm selling tools. going on Billy let's see here unlimited guide services he loves a car what's up Nick got Cecil let me see what you got Cecil got a 97 Camaro Z28 and then it went away it's rolling by faster than I can do it got my buddy Chris in the house what's up what's up Tyler I know you right Harry you, you gonna have to you gotta take the boat to work tomorrow Eli, what you got? Let's see, what are you doing? Eli, the other note was gone. My buddy Russell come took it out of shop for me. What's up, Patrick? Let's see, Roy, what's up, Rick? Chris is healing up. What's going on, Nick? Rusty, what's up? So that's the deal, y'all. That's the deal. The dyno was awesome. Learned a lot. Made great power. Even though it had a cylinder down, kind of. Uh, obviously not completely dead, but uh, that number one intake valve was just pouring. 100% uh, leak down. Uh, when I put the leak down gauge on it. So that explained a lot of our problems. We were kind of chasing a gremlin. And then uh, the last dyno pull, which wouldn't have been the last, but it became the last when fire went out of it. And we I said, we better we better wrap this deal up and let me uh, let me get this sucker home and, and get her sealed up tight and get her fixed. So uh, what we got here? What it is? Low lows. See, so come on to Paris. I know you right, Lee. It sure can be heartbreak. It can be Heartbreak Avenue, that's for sure. Let's see here, Linnell, what you got? Let's see. Maybe so, maybe so. Gotta get this sucker right. That's right, Andy. Hey, man, I like hanging out with all y'all. If y'all enjoy it, you know, it, it gives a little insight to what's going on, what I'm working on, where I'm going next, or, or whatever the case may be. And, you know, for for the people that enjoy it and kind of care about it and that kind of deal, hey, it just gives us all an opportunity to hang out. So if y'all like it, I love it, and we'll, we'll keep doing it, and everybody have a good time and ask you questions and get some shout-outs and, and just gives us something fun to do on Tuesdays, you know. Take a little break, sit down, you know, do your thing. What's going on, Keith? Jerry in the house. Corey says he loves that fuel tech dyno. I know you right. What's going on, Jason? Chris in the house. Let me swap this dude around. I'll show y'all. So, there's the jewelry. The jewelry. That's beautiful stuff right there, y'all. It ought not even be on no daggum motor. But anyway, we got an intake valve. 
Uh, got an intake valve that's knocked the seat kind of out of whack or whatever, you know, so 100% leak down, which uh, that's what ran into on the dyno. So for the ones that want to see a cool pic when we get off the live feed, go back to the assassin page, check out the little picture. Uh, that's on the dyno. You can see a little flame popping up. So I got it uh, I got it on there, but we learned we needed a fuel pump, so we put us a bigger fuel pump on there. Uh, going to get all that stuff fixed tomorrow. We'll have this bad boy. I'll, uh, I'll get her back up and kicking. I should have it running about a weekend or whatever. And then uh, for, my, for my truck peeps, for my 28 inch tire lovers, the Beetlejuice is making headway, y'all. I'm, I'm getting there. Uh, I'm getting there, and uh, we'll see what happens. I just got a text. Jeff James says he's headed over here. So we stick around and see if old Jeff makes it here or what. So I got the headers built. I got the headers built on old, uh, on Beetlejuice. Got the hot side done on the other side. Um, you know, just been working on it, y'all. Just been working on it. So, uh, like I said, uh, dry shaft came in. I've got the dry shaft put in. I've got the uh, dry shaft enclosure done. What's up, Alan? Now we now we got to stay on a little longer now because my buddy Jeff Jeff James just texts says I'm headed over here. He just late to the party, y'all. Late to the party. You believe that? So uh, maybe we'll uh, maybe we'll stick it out for a little bit and see see uh, give old Jeff a, a minute to get here. Maybe he'll maybe he'll slip in here and we'll hang out for a little bit. We got to find enough hot rod stuff to look at to keep everybody entertained till he gets here. What you got here, Lee? Let's see what you say. I don't know, Lee. I don't know about small tire at Centerville. Juice, possibly. Assassin, I'll probably stick on big tires. 100%. I will be at Centerville a lot this year. Um, you know, so I love that track. I mean, that's... Uh, you know, I love going up there. Beautiful, you know, beautiful place, all the trees. So I will 100% be there. I don't know of juice. I don't know if I'll have juice in small tire or not. Probably so. 100% assassin in big tire. Gonna be in there. So y'all just keep, keep your eye out. What's going on, Bobby? Let's see here. Let me look. Let me look. Let me look. I'm trying to catch up, y'all. Tudor, let's see here. What you got? Small tire. I know you right. We go we going to get we going to we going to try to be rough on them. We going to try to be rough on them. That's cool. That's right. Got my buddy Zach in the house. What's up? He said, "Better get them rigs ready." What you got, Harry? Let's see here. What you talking about? Put some radials on that Nova. Woo! Might have to. Oh, big tire. Oh, big tires little Little, uh, you know, I don't know. Big tire ain't got a lot of life in it, but I like it, and uh, I'll keep, I'll keep thrashing at it. But you never know, Harry. I may have to just put smalls on it, follow you around. You always know where the good ones is at, so we might have to do that. What's up, Timothy? We got them, Timothy. He says, "What size turbos is on them?" Man, that's just some little sixties, man. That's all they are, just some little sixties. They could be a touch bigger than that. I wouldn't lie to you. It kicked us off for a second. I'm just gonna try. To, I was gonna try to sneak back here, but every time I'm moving phone. Uh oh. Look out. Russell says Jeff's coming over here to negotiate a deal on something. They got. They got something kicking. Him and Russell got something kicking. You don't never know about them two. Dog, have you caught anything? Y'all, Nitro did catch a mouse yesterday. He said, Daddy, I caught one yesterday. He did. He thinks he's a cat. But hey, you just catch him. He watches for him to try to slip underneath this door right here. And he was on one yesterday. What's going on, Terry? So... So that's the deal. I got, I got all this stuff. I got all this jewelry snatched off there. We go tomorrow. We're gonna get the, we're gonna get that uh, intake valve fixed up. We ain't got no leak no more. 
And then we're going to be back at it. What's up, James? Let's see here. That's right, James. Hey, I'm headed back down to Gulfport. You can believe that. I love that place. I love the coast. Anybody that really, really knows me knows that I spend a lot of time down on the Gulf Coast. That's, uh, that's like my second home. Uh, it's about a seven-hour drive for me, but I'm down there very, very often. I love the little Gulfport track, so I'll definitely, I'll definitely be down there a lot. Uh, 2024, we're going to try to do some stuff. Miss Sherry Old Nitro is eight years old. He's an old man now. He says, Daddy, I'm not an old man. Hey, are you old? Are you an old man? Huh? He said, I feel it sometimes, that's for sure. I have to help him up on the couch if that tells you anything. What's up, Mike? Let's see here. Thank you, Mike. Front tires on Assassin. Oh, they just, they just some old 17 inch hoosers, y'all. Got them RC component wheels. I must like them. Because I run them on everything I got. I even got to set on my lawnmower. Thank you, Patrick. Let's see here. What you got, amen? That's right. Oh, JJ got a big old schedule he done throwed out there. What's up, Landon? Mr. Harold. He said, hey, that's the most loyal dog there is. I tell you, that's for sure. That one right there stays by my side. He wants to, if, I, if, I, if somebody comes up, somebody goes around, he's wanting to know where I'm at. That's for sure. What's up, Trey? He's been chewing on his little paw, y'all. He's, he's got his little paw messed up. Look here. What you got your little paw messed up for? But anyway, let's see here. What's up, Trey? Jimmy Dale. So that's right, that's right. So I'm thrashing, y'all. Like I said, uh, got these got these old headers. Got these old headers in the hot side done up. So I'm making some headway. I got the dry shaft in today, dry shaft enclosure in. Uh, when I get off the live feed, I'm going to work on it a little bit more tonight. Uh, I'm going to leave early in the morning. Go get the head fixed. Speaking of the devil, got my buddy Daniel in the house. He's going he's gonna to be the one fixing my little head up for me, y'all. We got an intake valve leaking, but he's going to get me squared away. What's up, Amos? What's going on, Scott? Yes, yeah, Scott, I, I do all my own stuff, good, bad, or ugly. It is what it is. Uh, if, if, if you see it in this shop, it's, it's stuff that I've done. Like I said, I... Uh, I, I got to take claim for the good, the bad, the ugly, the whatever. You know, it is what it is. So, uh, I, try to, I try to make everything fairly nice and neat. Uh, but, yep, yeah, that's it. That's just how it is. Uh, Yeah, Patrick, it won't be too terribly much. I think, um, um, honestly, I got the hot side is uh, is real close to the final two, the final uh, mandrels that I miscounted when I ordered my material. Uh, took a little more bends to get where I needed to go than I thought. So those came in today. I'll finish the hot side, you know, just whenever. Um, but yeah, once I do that, We'll, we're into plumbing and wiring, and uh, we'll probably be able to get that bad boy fired up, you know. And then obviously there's a lot more to it, though, y'all. Don't don't think that when it fires, it's ready to go racing, because I still got to do all my carbon fiber inserts in the floor and the back, and I've got to do the bed sides, bed mounts, uh, you know, the the bed cover, the wing, the parachute, the you know, just everything that it takes. There's a lot to it. I've made a lot of good headway. Um, you know, but it, it just all takes time, guys. I mean, time, money, and I just have to uh, kind of uh, work everything and make it all work. It's just how it is, you know. So, uh, what's up, Todd? Let's see here. Let me catch up, y'all. Yeah, Todd, I mean, me and JJ, we still hang out. We still do our stuff, you know. I still work on his cars, all that cool stuff. What's up, Dale? So I, 
I know I probably missed a lot, y'all. I was walking around, talking, and everything else. You know what I'm saying? So, so uh, anyway, but but yeah, that's it. So uh, maybe old, maybe old Jeff James will get over here in a minute. He texts, but he'll get to coming over here. Let me tell you about Jeff. Jeff is on the gravel road right now, coming from his house to my house. And then he's going to be looking for deer to cross the road. Then he's going to get sidetracked. Because there's three deer standing on the edge of the road. And he's going to stand there and look at them for ten minutes. <laughs> That's just how he is. That's just how he is, y'all. He has got it in his blood. Him and Lee Roberts, I can't keep them out of the trees or out of the water. That Degum Lee called me the other morning. I don't know, Saturday morning, I guess. Called, I didn't get in until real late from being at Fuel Tech, you know, so I didn't get in until 3. I, I, I slept till 9.30 or 10 or whatever. Lee done called me three or four times trying to get in my shop. He done let his boat motor freeze. They're over here trying to duck hunt in five-degree weather. I said, man, what's wrong with y'all chasing them birds in some five-degree weather? But, hey, man, everybody loves something, and I ain't, I ain't knocking it. But, but I, I'm too cold. I can't stay out there with that mess. So uh, I have to just stay, keep my little heater on, and I better stay in here and polish on these wheels or something because... Getting out there, uh, freezing, chasing them birds just don't work for me. What's up, Tim? Patrick, what's up? Let's see here. He said, wiring is the nightmare. Let's see here. What you got, Jimmy? Beetlejuice is 380, uh, it's a 388. 388 cubic inches. What's up, Tony? Let me catch up. Going on, Dale. Let's see here. I'm trying. I'm trying to keep up with everybody. Trying to keep up with everybody. Got my buddy David in the house. What's going on? He said, "Better late than never." He's in here. He got to see what's kicking. David, you have to go back and watch it now. You done missed all the good stuff. Yeah, Patrick. It don't take much motor, honestly. You know, for the guys that don't know the turbo stuff. You know, turbo applications, you know, short stroke, big bore, uh, smaller cubic inch seems to get it done. What's up, Sean? Let's see here. Let's see here. Andy says, y'all got to share this. You got to share these podcasts, y'all. You got to share these feeds so we get more people in here and get more interaction. Good job, Andy. Tell them. We got to share this thing. We got to keep everybody kicking. Can't, can't keep it all to ourselves. What's up, Ryan? Got my buddy Jesse. What's up? Jesse says, I'm finally here. He had to finish that milkshake. He said, I'm here now. I'm ready. What's going on, Stanley? Well, Stan, let's see here. Patrick said he had a, a, 10, what, a 106 on small block Ford. Hey, them small block Fords ain't no joke. Some of them Yates headed aftermarket block single turbo rigs will get down for sure. Like I said, it don't it don't take a lot of cubic inch when you puff that air in there. That's like that's like old assassin, you know, 526 cubic inches. That's not a lot, you know, when you got guys out there with eight, nine hundred cubic inch nitrous motors, but that boost, you don't need it. You just need a place to put the pressure. What's up, Paul? What's up, Ricky? <laughs> Jesse said, bust me out. They told what you was doing, man. What's going on, Danny? I wish I had a milkshake, Jesse. What are you talking about? <laughs> What's up, Joe? Ooh, 149 cubic inches. He got to get that .9, though. Now, you got, hey. See, you're late, Jesse. You missed what I, you missed what I had. He said, why is it a part? You missed what I, I had to tell everybody, what was going on. It's a little setback. Just a little, a little setback. Not that big a deal. We're going to get it. That there is an F3. That's just a, that's an F3 136, y'all. Just 
cookie cutter stuff. Just regular old, regular old. I'm mad. What are you talking about? Yeah, I'm jealous. I, Jesse, I'm jealous. You had the milkshake and I don't. That's what I'm talking about. That dead gum Harry Crane said Jesse Dickinson slow. Here we go. This is how it all gets started, y'all. This is how it all gets started. They make nasty power, that's for sure, Patrick. <laughs> they add it now. They add it now. Here we go. Here we go. Jeff said he'd be here, but I'm telling y'all, he has done turned his truck sideways in the gravel road trying to shine it on some deer. I know how he is. Shane, there's Juice. Juice just sitting over there waiting. No, Shane, I have not raced the Nova yet for 24. Uh, we did slip down to the dyno Friday to try to get some stuff lined out to get it ready to race. We had full intentions of going on down into Florida uh, to do a little testing, do a little grudge racing, whatever. Uh, it didn't work out because once we got it on the dyno, we started finding a few little problems. It still made absolute insane power even considering cylinder one had uh, intake valve leaking, which is what we finally figured out was the problem. 100% uh, leak down on cylinder one, so I loaded it up and brought it home. Let's see here, what you got, Russell? Russell says he, he gotta get back to work. Man, Russell, you ain't gotta lie to everybody. It is raining. And it is cold and it is dark. You ain't working. You sitting somewhere listening to the radio looking at that big ass boat. That ain't working. Hey, Andy, he is for sure a big buck killer too. He he got several on the wall. You can believe that. Russell act like he's gonna work. What's up, Landon? Let's see here. Let me catch up. Got my buddy Manny. What's up? New Mexico in the house. I don't know, Patrick. I don't know if Steve Petty's still with ProLine or what the whole deal is with that. I don't really know. You know, I, I'm not really sure about that. What's up, Paul? That's right, Paul. Russell Shoreline. <laughs> What's going on, Mark? Ah, uh, Jimmy, there, it's not bad. Uh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. We got us a visitor, y'all. He, he, them deer run off. They run across the field, and and he said, "Well, I might as well slip on down there." I told him, I said, "I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna tell. I'm gonna tell you what I told everybody else." I said, y'all, Jeff James texted me and said he's coming. I said, but what y'all need to know is he lives down the gravel road across the hill from my house. What time it would be. And I know. said, I'm telling you what he's done. He is slipping across there, and he has done seen three deer cross the road. Right now, he's got his truck turned sideways in the gravel road trying to shine the headlights at three deer. See how big the rack is. Well, <laughs> you're telling the truth. <laughs> Yeah, that's right, that's right. What's up? What's up, Amy? Yeah, Shane, that's right. Big block killer in the house. He's here, hanging out with us. So, uh, he just loafing today. It's wet. I know he ain't tromping around to the deer stand today. So, too wet to do anything. Too wet to do anything. Old Nitro says, I got somebody here to pet me now. I'm all good. He's all good. So, uh... Now, Miss Angie, I don't know where you're at this Tuesday because you normally always here and you're always talking about, where's Jeffrey? Where's Jeffrey? So I had him come here today just for you, Miss Angie. And, 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 and there he is. So now when you come back and watch the live feed later, I, I tried to help you out. Now, maybe next time we get your buddy Lee Roberts over here. 
Let's see here. What's up, Harry? Let me let me try to catch up, y'all. It's rolling by faster than I can read it. Alan says, what's up, Jeff? Everybody, Patrick says, what's up? Miss Sherry says, hey, Jeff. What's going on? So, uh, let's see here. Mark says, what's going on, Jeffrey? Let's see. Tim in the house. He says, what's up, Jeff? So, Jimmy Dale says, what's up? So, anyway, like I said, he left. I left the lift up. And I'll double stack them in here and whatever. We, we just make the best of it. What's going on, Danny? He says, what's up, Big Block Killer? What's going on? Yeah, Miss Sherry. Sometimes, I don't know, with the rain and everything, my service, even though we're on uh, fiber optic internet, you know, I mean, it's still, if you move funny, it'll cut off. I don't know. Let's see here. Hey, man. Oh, Big Block Killer is, uh, the car is ready to go. We, we really, our next plans, I think, is to just get it on the dyno. Um, just kind of get it, get it dynoed up and start testing with it. You know, we did a, we did a pro-charged LS combo in it. Uh, it's, it's fuel tech fuel injected now and we just gotta, we just gotta get after it just like we're doing Assassin. So maybe after we get Assassin done, maybe we can take old, uh, Big Block Killer down there and, and do a little work to it or something. Gotta get the transmission back in. Yeah, gotta put the transmission back in. Uh, so let's see here. I'm trying to catch up, y'all. It rolls by. What's up, Duffy? Aaron, what's up? So it rolls by, y'all. I try to keep up. I know everybody's saying what's up, and, and Jeff will get on here later, and he can he can scroll through and see who's who's saying what and that kind of deal. So I just figured it would be a, just a little opportunity for everybody to get to see him. Everybody's asking what's up, and so he was just kind of loafing and came back to see us a little bit, so... Uh, but anyway, but like I said, I'm gonna, I'm gonna show y'all one more go round. We'll, uh, like I said, on Assassin, just to sum it up, we got an intake valve leaking. Uh, we're gonna, I'm gonna go get that bad boy fixed tomorrow. My buddy Daniel over at Design Performance, they're gonna get my head fixed up. We're gonna get old Assassin all back together. We'll get that little jewelry back on the motor. Beetlejuice, y'all know the deal. Headers, hot side, all that stuff's done. Uh, got the dry shaft in today, the tunnels in today, so those that uh, want to kind of keep up and see what's up, let's see here. Yeah, Miss Sherry, I promise you, that's what took him so long to get over here. He's over here trying to hunt them deers on his way over here. He don't give them no break, I promise y'all that. You go in his office, he's just got deer heads up everywhere. What's going on, Billy? So anyway, so that's the deal. I'm just, uh, we working. We're just trying to make it all happen. So, uh, but anyway, that's kind of the deal. So, guys, that's going to be our Tuesday. That's going to be our Tuesday show. Uh, glad everybody jumped on here and hung out with us. Share it. Catch up with us next Tuesday. You never know. Old Jeff might be back over here. Maybe not. We got to get him out of the tree stand. So, uh, but anyway, so, uh. That's it. Stay safe, stay warm. Y'all take it easy. See you next Tuesday. Be good.